Today we're going to look at a scene from Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. You know that great scene whenever he's holding a heart and the heart starts burning by itself? We're going to try to replicate this in the lab. <laughs> Alright, so we're reproducing this experiment in the lab. We're going to be using the popular reaction between brake fluid and pool chlorine. The idea is that in pool chlorine, there's a high percentage of calcium hypochlorite. And in brake fluid, there's a lot of ether glycols and stuff like that. Whenever you mix them to the two of them together, you get a spontaneous combustion, meaning you have no sign of the reaction until a point where it generates so much heat through a radical mechanism that it starts igniting and fire comes out of what seems to be nowhere. But we want to step it up a notch, so we're going to do this reaction using a pig's heart. We're going to be putting our chemicals inside that pig's heart, and we're going to try to get it to spontaneously ignite, just like in Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. So we've already put the calcium hypochlorite inside the beaker that's inside the heart, and now we're going to put brake fluid inside. The reaction should take about one minute, so we'll need some incantation, and then spontaneous combustion. Brake fluid. Ready? Got him Got him Got him Kalima! <laughs> ha There you go, that's chemistry. All right, this experiment is pretty cool. But it's still dangerous, so make sure you work safely, all right? Pool chlorine is uh, corrosive, wear gloves, and brake fluid's a bit toxic, so make sure you work outdoors or near a fume hood. Other than that, enjoy ripping some hearts out. Cheers.